the summer is not all fun and berries. There are also apples. As a side note, my potatoes actually took off. And they seem to be growing quite happily. But I haven't seen them blossoming, so I don't know about their status. Not getting my hopes up, but who knows. So it is late summer and I am on my way to the countryside, coming from the train and all. Left all the um, apple abundance in town unattended for another time. Everything looks just as wild as earlier in summer. I haven't been here that much this summer anyway, so yeah. <laughs> Welcome to the jungle. Mm -hmm. Bonus jungle. Ah, that would be my dad making his way over here. Very slowly. Apparently he has caught something earlier. There is a net on the water and it's moving. I have returned to my usual foraging grounds to see if I can score some fox birds. And... Jackpot! So, autumn in the garden. Phase 2. This is where proper autumn is about to kick in. The summer apples have mostly dropped down, maybe a few left. The proper autumn apples are still coming up in, I don't know, a few weeks, I guess? Yeah, we should probably address that. So, the autumn has advanced another notch. And it's now proper chilly and even the most wishful thinking can't fool you into believing it's, it's actually still summer. And that means summer apples are out, autumn apples are in. And today we have a plan to do some jamming. So my plan with these bad boys is to mix them with some uh, foxberries because I think the flavours go well together. This one is also a little bit bittery, something, something, foresty. Let's see how that goes. The days are actually getting quite chilly and I remembered that I have that potato thing still in the air, so today I'm gonna try and harvest some. I have the technology. Hmm. Oh, apparently. A tiny red potato has spawned a few more tiny red potatoes. Well, I would say that trying to properly harvest this patch is not the worthwhile endeavor. So I think I'm just going to leave the tiny second generation of tiny potatoes to pee in the ground and then Perhaps uh, next spring they, there will be a miracle or something, but I think, yeah, at this point, I'm just gonna leave them be. Meanwhile, 
the results of the uh, weekend's jamming session. Well, not all of them, some are in the fridge. They're covered up to ensure that they cool more evenly. Apples. Rains and repeat. It's October now, and I can make a little conclusion to the whole autumn versus garden versus apples business. See, we have picked most of them by now, turned them into, beaten them into pulp, turned them into juice, and and uh, some epic jam. And right now we have one, two, two and a half trees still left to harvest, and these we shall store over winter. As for my adventurous potatoes, I shall leave them to rest. And in the spring I might uh, pile on some uh, more fertile soil and see if the second generation shows more hope. Like I said, October.